This is a tour of Reggae Lane, designated as such in 2015 by the City of Toronto. This is what they tribute us with. Right here at uh, Eglinton and Marley, a little between Marley, just west of Marley, uh, and it goes all the way down to um, Oakwood. Here are some of the luminaries of Reggae, reggae Way. Here is uh, Adrian Hale. Hales uh, did this mural. He did the second one down the way. This is it, you can see. Hey, this is my man, Pluggy Satchmo, Selassie I, Bernie Pitters. There's all kind of people here that you might know. This is Reggae Lane. And here's a parking lot, right up from Spencer's and Raps and so on on the block at Eglinton and Oakwood, Mali. And here is, this is Reggae Lane, really. The illustrious Reggae Lane. Let's take a walk down here. about 7.30 a.m. Monday, October 5th. Let's back up a second. This is behind Raps Restaurant, Spencer's Restaurant, Barbershop, and this is Reggae Lane. Do you see any insignias? Sorry, I'm gonna be in the picture. Do you see any decorations? This, y'all, is Reggae Lane. Walk down Reggae Lane. See anything reggae about it? been five years. They promised that they'd have a big concert in July that year with uh, Leroy Sibbles, July 15th or something I thought, and to debut the avenue or the laneway. Nothing has happened. The road hasn't been fixed. Nothing has been done except just them designating it as Reggae Lane. This is Reggae Lane. And here, probably the only two beautiful things about Reggae Lane is Adrian Hales's two murals. Beautiful work, brother, got to say. Again, this is Reggae Lane. We're coming up on uh, Oakwood right now. Mm. 
Reggae Lane. This is Reggae Lane. Except for the two murals, do you see anything reggae about this lane? It's been five years since they've designated this laneway reggae lane. Look at the work that hasn't been done. This is reggae lane. 